Hey everyone, if you enjoyed this video, do make sure to like and subscribe and come hang out with us in Discord. Hello, Draft Rig YouTube. It's Gavega17, your DLC here, back with his final regular season match of our Bolt Wi-Fi League. Last week, our opponent had something come up and so we were unable to play, which leaves us here sitting at three and two, meaning that if we win this game, we have a really good chance of making playoffs, but if we lose it, you know, there's too many good teams in here, like Pies and uh, just some others that are just right there at the same record as me. So I've got to beat Jay, who is a server favorite, and uh, really capitalize on this. So um, we're bringing our um, team of Gyarados, Infernape, Altaria, Rabombi, Crocodile, and Toxtricity. We're bringing kind of a hyper offense team because Jay's team is really solid. Um, that being said, um, I'll tell you more about our team when we're kind of in the match. I was a little pressed for time or else I would have, you know, gotten to it a little bit more here. Um, Infernape has an amazing matchup into Jay. Um, and so does Crocodile. I feel like what I want to do is potentially lead Infernape and then just see how it goes and hope they don't lead Greninja, Greninja. Although they may lead Greninja, so I'm actually going to lead Altaria and just hope. Because, you know, Jay's team is so solid that if I lead wrong, it could just be bad against anything so we've really just got to try our best here and hope we can gain some momentum because their team was super hard to switch on which is kind of why I brought an HO team rather than a standard balance team. Scarf Crocodile is with Moxie can set up and win as well as uh, my Dragon Dance Gyarados. We are defensive with Will-O-Wisp Hurricane, Alluring Voice, Roost. We're gonna just go for a Hurricane and hope we don't miss. Bonk. Okay. I think Jay's gonna wanna preserve this. So we're gonna go for a Willow on the swap. Actually, they're just gonna tear us, so I may have trolled myself. Okay. It's a lot of damage. We kind of can heal up with the Altaria. Um, I feel like I live any hit with this. And I'm just gonna sludge bomb. That's fine. We don't need our throw spray necessarily. So there's our Terra down. Decent start for us. What the hell?
feel like I go into this. And I just click Moonblast. Don't poison. Beautiful. We sack our guy. We could just mock punch. <coughs> Get swapped from Jane. I kind of just want to flare blitz for damage because. Yeah, oh. Damn. Yo, Infernape is really good all season. I was not expecting that to kill, but. It is a life orb. Definitely the crit mattered. I'm pretty sure. And then we can just mock punch this. Some Iron Fist Life Orb. Inf Infernape, do not miss your Stone Edge. Let's go, Infernape! Well, Infernape went kind of crazy there, I'm not going to lie. With that being said, it was a good match to Jay. I was super scared of their team. I'm just going to click the safe uh, knockoff. And just go through with my Scarf Crook and call it a day. GG's to Jay. Hopefully they don't have any shenanigans that can kill me. Um, yeah, I don't know why the co recording cut out a little weird and I was having some audio issues, but GG's to Jay. Jay played great. The crit on the girder most likely mattered and sucked. Um, we'll be four and two, so depending on what happens in the final week, I think we make playoffs. Um, and if we make playoffs, I'm coming for you, Flygon. That's all I have to say. Um, thank you for watching the match, and uh, thank you for everything. 
it's been a great regular season, and if we don't make the playoffs, then, you know, it's still fun. 4-2 and two is a respectable record. So, shout-out to Jay. Shout-out to all the coaches I played this season.